Hi, in this video I am going to give you some tips which is very important to your Microtech router administration. So first, never change your Microtech router physical interface name poorly. give you some example so let's see this is my magnetic router physical interface this is a uh, ether one two three four five six um, if I connect my ISP one this ether one and change the name ISP one yes number 20 office is LAN number four interface name is not like ISP ISP and um, after that uh, number three four five six and uh, uh, randomly change the every interface name so part 7 in future you can see this already ISP1 ISP, ISP LAN 1 2 3 randomly serialed by router and after that ether theory is it ether theory on this serial it's have to be in number one two three in this test but now with a three is in number four so just think in future what will happen we can we cannot uh, take the physical interface to our logical interface name it will very difficult to find this kind of situation to your to run like as uh, ethernet interface name ip address uh, which, uh, which interface will assign your ip address it will create a big confusion so never do this uh, always add your required name with this like like as ether3 underscore isp ether5 underscore wi-fi user will be very clear for you and uh, also others uh, who is using um, uh, administrate your router so second thing never use the default admin user also I suggest never use your username like as root because uh, admin and root user are a very common user for um, hitting list for hackers uh, when uh, someone try to ha access your router they will first try with your admin user or root user so never use this uh, to username always uh, you can uh, use user one or something others you want to use and uh, use it two three four five six like this and uh, always remove the rem admin or root user this will be a very good practice third Disable your unused port. This port uh, is not required to log in. For example, if I am going to IP service, in this section, 
uh, we can see the login available ports are here uh, if I don't use FTP I have to disable it always API API SSL not required to log in for me you have to disable your uh, unused port with, with you uh, which uh, is not required for you well you can also add your available address um, as per port basis this uh, from from this address only router uh, allowed to hit on this port it will increase your router security many 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 times Last, always update your router's firmware. It is very important for your security and also router stability. You can update your router's firmware from system router board packages and also from files. You can check the update firmware which is uh, available from online. You can update it as per requirement. It will uh, update your router security and uh, stability. This is a very good practice to maintain your MicroTik router. Thank you.